As Taylor Swift stirred honey into her coffee, the smell of freshly made coffee filled the room. She lived in Nashville. The windows let in lots of sunlight, which gave the walls a warm glow. The calm atmosphere was very different from the feelings in her stomach. Travis Kelsey, her boyfriend of six months, had said he would surprise her today. They had already talked about getting married, but Taylor insisted on a long engagement so that they could enjoy the happiness of being engaged. Travis, who is always the lover, agreed, but he's been hinting that they should speed up time lately. Travis walked into the kitchen with a playful twinkle in his eye and said, Good morning, my love. His deep voice echoed through the room. He gave Taylor a hug, and the smell of his cologne mixed with the smell of coffee. Taylor chirped, morning, Trav, to hide how excited she was. What's this surprise you've been teasing? On the coffee table, Travis pointed to a stack of papers and a small satin box. He then led her to the living room. He smiled bigger as he saw Taylor's eyes get bigger. Okay, this is not a small surprise at all, Taylor said with a nervous laugh as he reached for the box. A beautiful emerald cut diamond ring was lying on a bed of satin inside. It was just as bright as the sparkle in Travis's eyes. Taylor Allison Swift, Travis said first, his voice full of emotion. This is the first part of my surprise. I know you wanted to say yes for a long time, but I just had to marry you now. The happiness in Taylor's heart grew big. She nodded, but she couldn't say anything because tears were in her eyes. Travis carefully put the ring on her finger, making sure it fit perfectly. Now, for the second part of my surprise, he said, adding a playful lilt to his voice. I bought a house for us. It's in Kansas City, close to my family, and there's plenty of space for a future family. Taylor let out a gasp and put her hand to her mouth. Travis's words hit her like a wave and took away any worries she had about their future together. A family? Was he making a dig at? Travis grabbed her hands when he sensed an unsaid question from her. Taylor, I love you so much that words can't describe it. I want to build a family and make moments with you for the rest of my life. The next step for us is this house. Taylor's eyes were filled with tears, but these were tears of joy. She wrapped her arms around Travis, and the sound of their laughing filled the house. It worked to surprise them. A ring and a house were the two things Travis gave Taylor at the same time that made their wedding inevitable. Their future together, which had only been a dream before, was now a real possibility. Taylor knew that this was just the start of their happily ever after as they stood there with their arms around each other. She was excited to see what surprises the future held. The huge house in Kansas City was baking in the sun as Taylor Swift hung out by the pool with her best friend Selena Gomez. Their laughter echoed through the air as they talked. Travis Kelsey, Taylor's boyfriend and a star tight end for the Kansas City Chiefs, came out of the house with a secret in his eyes. Hey there, sunshine, Travis said as he walked up to the two women. His voice was full of playful love. When Taylor saw the sly grin in Travis's eyes, she sat up. Her heart skipped a beat. He didn't look at her that way unless he was planning something. What's that look for, Kelsey? With a sly smile on her face, Taylor asked. Travis leaned in close and sat down next to her. He put his hand on hers and looked like he was up to something. It was a low whisper that he spoke. I've got a couple of surprises for you, babe. Two things that are gonna make our wedding inevitable. Taylor took a deep breath. Even though they had only been dating for a few months, it was clear that they were meant to be together. Still, just hearing the word, wedding, made her feel very excited. Oh yeah? She asked with a raised eyebrow. And what might those be? Travis smiled, and his eyes sparkled with love and promise. He reached into his pocket and said, First, I got us a puppy. He put up a small golden retriever. The dog's big eyes looked up at Taylor with love. Taylor gasped and her heart melted when she saw the cute animal. She squealed and grabbed the puppy, saying, Oh my god, Travis. He's perfect. Travis laughed, and the way Taylor reacted made his heart swell with joy. He knew she had wanted a dog for a long time. He had more planned for her than that, though. Then, he reached into his other pocket and said, I talked to your dad. He told me it was okay. 
Taylor looked at him with wide eyes, and her heart started to beat fast. She looked at Travis with a lot on her mind. Things were moving quickly, but it felt right with Travis. Really? She asked in a low voice, full of feeling. Travis nodded, and his eyes didn't move. Really, he said, and his voice was full of love and truth. I know it's early, but I can't imagine spending my life with anyone else. When Taylor put her arms around Travis, tears came to her eyes. The puppy curled up between them. Oh, Travis, she cried out happily, I love you so much. Selena watched with a big smile as they hugged. She knew this was the start of a very long and amazing love story. She was excited to see what had in store for her best friend and the guy who had won her heart. Long shadows stretched across Travis Kelsey's estate's large yard as the sun went down over Kansas City. Inside, Taylor Swift was sitting in a soft couch and tracing the edge of her wine glass for no reason. As Travis walked into the room, she smiled a silly smile. He had a secret in his eyes. What's that look for, Kelsey? Taylor asked, with a funny tone in her voice. Travis sat down next to her and took her hand. His voice was low and rumbling as he said, Babe, I have two things to tell you. Two things that will make our wedding inevitable. Taylor's eyebrows went up in shock. Really? Tell me. When Travis leaned in, his breath rubbed against her ear. First, he said in a whisper, I've been taking dance lessons in secret. Taylor laughed out loud as he imagined the six feet five inches tight and trying to do a graceful dance. Are you dancing? I need to see this. Travis smiled, not giving up. Swift, just wait for the wedding. I'll knock you off your feet. The thought made Taylor's heart race. And the second thing? Travis's face became less angry. He told her, I wrote a song for you. A wedding song. Taylor's eyes got really big in shock. Travis, you didn't. He nodded, and his eyes didn't move. I put everything I had into it. And Zone of Love is the name of it. Taylor felt a wave of happiness. She knew Travis wasn't the most emotional person, but this was so much worse than she had thought. She reached out to cup his face with her hands as tears filled her eyes. You're unbelievable, she said in a deep voice. I love you so much. Travis leaned in, and they kissed passionately. Their eyes lit up with happiness as they split up. She said, so, with a sly grin on her face. When's the wedding? Travis laughed and pulled her closer. Come on, my love. Soon. We laughed, played music, and talked about our goals for the rest of the night. They danced under the moonlight, and the sound of their love filled the room. Taylor knew one thing for sure as the night came to an end, she was going to marry Travis, and it was going to be amazing. It wasn't the end of the end zone of love.